Hi everybody, welcome to Bloomcast where we explore floral business solutions and today we explore Walmart Go Local, a delivery service provider for retail floors. So stay tuned. Hey guys, welcome back. My name is Renato Cruz Sugeko, AAF PFCI, and I'm the VP of Digital Strategy here at BloomNet, and I'm the host of Bloomcast. And today, we're going to talk about the importance of delivery. So for more than a year, we've been working with Walmart Go Local, Walmart's um, delivery service platform, to offer reliable same-day delivery to our customers, BloomNet member florists. Today, we'll be talking a little bit more about the value delivery can bring to our business and what you need to know more about um, Walmart Go Local. We have two special guests with us. Uh, the first, uh, the gentleman on the left is Yogi Patel. He uh, is the owner of two flower shops in Inglewood and in Cyprus, and he's going to share a little bit more about his experience um, with the service. And we also have Ruby Daly, senior manager um, for Walmart Go Local. Uh, before we get into the meat of it, um, I'd like to uh, pick on you, Yogi, a little bit because I'd like for the audience to get to to know you. How long have you been in business uh, and share a little bit more about your retail experience? So I have been an owner for the last 24 years and we had at one point up to five stores and now we're down to two. Uh, with the two stores we're down to and thanks to Walmart, we were able to cover almost 80% of Orange County and 80% of LA County. Uh, so basically the two biggest markets in Southern California are covered by us by almost 80%. That makes life so much easier, makes it so much easier for all our customers because we don't have to rely on somebody to do a crappy job and get it delivered and when it comes out of our store. And now let's, uh, uh, let's have Ruby introduce yourself. Yeah, my name is Ruby Daly. I am a senior manager on the client success team at Walmart Go Local handling the day-to-day -day client relationships with uh, partners such as uh, 1-800-Flowers and BloomNet. Oh, thank you so much, Ruby. Um, Ruby, let's start with you. Sure. Can you start by sharing a bit more about Walmart Go Local and how uh, we are working together uh, from, from the perspective of uh, uh, Walmart Go Local working uh, with BloomNet? Yeah, of course. Absolutely. Thank you. So Walmart Go Local is basically a white label delivery solution that we created to help businesses such as 100 flowers in the franchises. So right now we're servicing about 800 shops um, across mm -hmm. the United States. And we have a couple different propositions we're offering today. So we're offering a one hour express delivery through our driver network. That's point to point, as well as a three hour scheduled delivery solution, which um, enables you to have a batched order. And what that means is that a driver can take up to four arrangements, confections, et cetera, in one route. You know, we've seen how popular delivery has become over the past few years. You know, can you talk uh, a little bit more about the just the importance of delivery and why it's important for retail floors? Yeah, absolutely. So I think just since the pandemic, especially, we have really changed just how soon we can have everything. Basically, anything could be delivered on demand. So. Um, Walmart Go Local, the whole mission and goal is to help support retailers, especially florists and, and businesses, um, have the opportunity to service their clients with same day delivery from as little as one hour to, you know, by the end of the same day. All right, Yogi, let's turn it over to you. So how, how have you seen uh, this service impact your business? And the second part of the question is, what are your customers looking for with delivery? So our business has impacted with going through the whole COVID epidemic that just allowed us that everybody wants to send some sort of gift since they couldn't get out there. So we had gone from doing 35, 40 deliveries on a busy day up to 80 to 100 deliveries. And we're not even talking about major holidays. And we were just with Walmart Go allowing us that we just set it up. We could have 25, 30 orders and they could be anywhere. We didn't have to worry about, hey, Joe's needs to take this. Solis needs to take this. We just let Walmart say, hey, Walmart, we got our orders ready. They came in, they picked up the three, four, everybody, and off they went. 
So it made our life a lot easier for us of not having to have to worry about the logistics of who's picking it up and who's going where as long as it got delivered. And the one hour window worked out even really well because literally you could have your an order delivered within an hour of placing it as long as we had it made and ready to go. You know, so Yogi, um, we all know how uh, this floral business, it needs to scale up uh, a lot, at least twice this year. Um, how do you feel, uh, you know, whether Walmart local has really met those needs? I mean, is, is this something that could scale up to, to meet those uh, peak, the peak demands for the florist? So our peak demands, of course, is Valentine's mm -hmm. and Mother's Day. And during that time, we used to have to bring in 15, 25, 40 drivers just making sure they would show up. Now, these past few years that we've been using Walmart, we have not brought anybody on besides our everyday drivers. You know, like, hey, you're on our payroll, you're just there, and they help in stores. Most of almost, I think this past Mother's, I think we did 85% of our deliveries through Walmart. And we didn't have to worry about it. They came professionally, they picked up everything, and they like, hey, I'll be back quick as I can, I'll be back quick as I can. And then, not a problem. They just kept rolling in, rolling out. So it allowed us to meet the needs of the customers because sometimes, you know, people do make late orders late on the Valentine projections that are being set. And, you know, also allows us to also stay open longer to take on these orders because I don't have to worry about, hey, is Joe mm -hmm. going to come back? If Joe doesn't come back. Well, always got another 15 other guys to come get it. That's really interesting because, you know, like the, the, the number one challenge that I hear all the time from Flores during those peak times is finding that that reliable delivery crew, you know, to, to, to fill out that need. And if you're telling us right now that Walmart go local with, with Walmart go local, you, you stick to your core drivers and they uh, literally are able to uh, scale up to meet that peak demand. That's awesome. That's great. Yeah. It's made life a lot easier for us. I mean, if, if the drivers can take funerals for us, we wouldn't even have drivers anymore. That's how easy it's become for us. Like that's, I mean, cost efficiency, reliability is our biggest thing, just for them to show up on a timely manner. I mean, if the system tells you, hey, they're going to be here at 11 o'clock, you just have to have it ready by 11 o'clock. You pick the time you want them to go out with it. So it's not like it's one of those things like, hey, I'm waiting. Why aren't you got my stuff ready? You told them 11 o'clock and that's all you have to do is get it ready. So, so let's talk a little bit more about uh, the system, Ruby. Um, are, are there certain yeah. features that uh, Walmart Go Local offers that uh, give Floris, that seamless experience that um, Yogi is talking about? Yeah, absolutely. Um, I think a couple things to kind of harp on are, you know, our proof of delivery. It's, first of all, it's all customizable by shop. So you can have your delivery be um, require a signature, a photo. You can kind of decide if you want it to be um, an attended delivery, an unattended delivery. So it's all customizable. And with the proof of delivery, we've actually seen that you're three times less likely to have any type of customer complaint returns, et cetera. So that's really great. Um, and then because we are working with the Walmart network, we just have so much coverage, especially in rural areas. Um, so you can expand your mileage, deliver to further, further homes that maybe, you know, your in-house driver wouldn't want to drive 20 miles, but we'll do that for you. Um, and then obviously the cost savings that come with the batching and just having less drivers in your stores are, are really beneficial to the shops logistics. Yogi. So, you know, you've been at this for, for quite a while. Uh, what, what would you share with other shop owners looking to set up delivery with Walmart go local? Is there, are there any best practices or learnings that uh, you got from, you know, being part of the service? So our drivers that have been coming to our Cypress and Inglewood location, actually, sadly to say like this, they fight to come back because they're like, it's so much easier because they realize, because these guys are picking up three, four orders going into the similar areas. It's not like they're going five miles left, 10 miles north, 10 miles south. Like it's a, it's a good batch and they make a decent living on it, but they like it because we actually prep them well. So they get a box, they get a cushion, you know, so they're set. So when they deliver, they deliver the whole exact thing and it doesn't look like garbage and doesn't have to worry about falling it out out of their cars. And, you know, so it works. It's a win-win for all of us. And I mean, today we had orders go out and this lady came back for the second time, you know, and, and everybody that's came in today, they're like, oh, now we know why we want to keep coming back because it's so much easier because you just literally have to just 
organize them, put them right in your car, and put them in your little carrier boxes that they have, and they're off to go. Yogi, Ruby, thank you so much for your time today. Uh, just to close, uh, Ruby, can you share uh, more about how our florists can sign up uh, for Walmart Go Local? Yeah, so within the actual BloomNet portal, there is an option to opt in. Um, and then somebody should reach out to you about doing the setup. It's super easy. It only takes a couple minutes. And then there's also an email that um, we can provide in the in the summary that you can email in with any questions or if you want more information to get signed up as well. Well, you know, thanks again for your time. And in case you do have any questions, you know, please leave them in the comments or certainly send us an email and we'll go ahead and post it uh, right at the bottom of the screen. Uh, thanks again, guys, for your time. And uh, thank you for sharing so much about uh, Walmart Go Local with our viewers. Thank, thank you. you. Thanks for having us. Bye. Thank you.